Hey everybody, VamCalf back again. So I had a request to make a video for how I set up the failsafe for my Eoshin QX105, also known as the Bayat. The Bayat. So I guess it's a failsafe and it isn't. It's a manual failsafe. So it's pretty much if you get run into a tree and your motors, you know, it's it's more or less like to arm and disarm. But also the just to show that the failsafe works. Um, but yeah, so anyway, so I went in to my receiver and set up and for auxiliary channels. I have channel five, which is uh, the arm, also the the failsafe for the Eoshin is on channel five. So I went ahead and put it to the VRA, which is this little knob right here, to twist and turn. So at the 50% mark, that's your arm and disarm. So it's a real quick flip to turn it on and off. Uh, so I'll show you that it works. So channel five VRA. And that's, once again, that's in the auxiliary channels for, this, for the little tool system function setup. It's actually not in where you would think it would be, uh, let's see here, for the fail safe, if I can find it, oh no, I guess that's also in here, so it's not in, where is it, where's the fail safe, oh my god, sorry about that. There, RX setup. It's not in here. I have it off. All channels. Alright? So your receiver should look like, or your transmitter should look like this. All off on your failsafe. Alright, so now just to show you that it actually works, let's go ahead and plug my battery in. Do its normal beeping. Now it's armed. Move that cup out of the way so I don't go running into stuff. And then arm it again. Oh, oh. Arm it. I'm just show you that this works also. Okay, and one more time to show you that the failsafe actually works, like the legit, so I got manual failsafe and a, and a, I guess, auto failsafe or whatever for one that loses transmission. But so here, now so it's armed again, I'll turn it on, turn the remote off, and it kills, okay? So I mean, I don't know if the new beta flight or if the new uh, Eoshin QX 105s, because I literally just got this, here I'll unplug that, I literally just got this. I don't know, less than a month ago. So they might have a new batch where they fixed the failsafe problem, but uh, this will add, that'll add to the, your manual ability to um, arm and disarm your quad. And also just showing that indeed the failsafe does work. I don't know if how I have it set up, if that helped at all with having this work with the failsafe, but I did absolutely nothing in beta flight. I did nothing on a computer programming this uh, ESC. This is just how it came out of the box and how I found out uh, to get this to work. So I guess one more time to show you how to get in there. So once you are got your uh, transmitter on, it's in setup and you can go to auxiliary channels. Now this was just my choice, but you don't want to use either of the any of these three channels. Uh, and I'll show you I guess, well, I guess I don't have to show you. Like This is like your sport mode, or I guess to go from regular to uh, acro mode. And this is, um, oh, I can't remember what it was. Something to have to do with elevation. And this is like an auto takeoff for getting it to just fly up to a certain elevation and then hold. But So this is your, this is how I have it set up for arming. So channel, channel 5 is your fail safe. And I switched it to VRA. And then save, you hold cancel. And then go into RX setup. Where the hell is it? I just found it.
There it is. RX setup, fail safe, off, all channels. Save that. And there you have it. Hope that helped. Uh, if there's any other questions, go ahead and leave me a comment. And uh, yeah, um, I hope the fail safe works for you guys.